And if it rains, I guess we'll swim. What? What? What do you mean if it rains? <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to this week's weekly vlog. My name is Jasmine. If this is your first time here on my channel, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. So today is Tuesday. I'm just going to be vlogging my day. I'm about to go to work right now. Um, some of you guys ask me where I work, I, like what I do for work. I'm an LPN, so a licensed practical nurse. So yeah, that's my 9 to 5. So yeah. Alright, I'm about to drive down to work. I work in the city and I live outside of the city, so... Let's go. Yes, he was playing with his holster. Just arrived down to my job. Um, I'm about to just powder my face a bit. Today I use this tinted moisturizer. Um, I wanted to try it out without the Rare Beauty Primer. So a couple weeks ago I tried this tinted moisturizer from Laura Mercier. And I tried it with the Rare Beauty Primer. But... And it made me really, really oily. So a couple of you all have told me that you really liked it. And maybe it was the primer and not the um, tinted moisturizer. So I decided to try it out today without that primer to see how it worked on my skin. Um, but I'm going to set some powder. I'm going to put some powder on my face because I usually put powder anyway. Um, just to help keep me a little bit um, matter. My face is just super oily so... I like to put some type of powder on and this is just the Urban Decay All Nighter Powder and hopefully this just helps with my oil. It is literally at 90 something degrees today so it must, it's probably not, mm, there's hair on my mouth, it's probably not the best day to do this experiment to be honest like I feel like I'm not giving this tinted moisturizer a fair chance because this weather is crazy. <laughs> But, we'll see. Like, maybe it will survive this weather. You never know. So, yeah, I'm just trying to see how it's going to stay on my face. I'm going to just spray on my perfume. I brought my Vanilla Woods with me. This one. Can y'all see that? This one. I'm just going to spray that on me. And I need to grab, I want to grab coffee, so I'm going to leave now. So I have time to grab coffee before I head in. I'm going to just drink like half of it. Or maybe, a, I'm just going to take a few sips, y'all. Because I just kind of feel, felt like having a few sips of cold brew. But I'm not going to drink the whole thing. Because I can't. I'm not trying to drink all these calories, so I'm just going to drink a little bit of it. Okay. I'm trying to keep the camera out of the sun because it's so hot that if I put it in the sun it's going to overheat. Um, so this is such an awkward angle. Um, by the way you guys, the foundation, the tinted moisturizer is not bad. Like it's lasting in this weather which is, this weather is crazy. I'm getting a little oily but it's really the weather. Like it's crazy hot. Like it's do the right thing, spikely hot outside right now. I got an avocado toast for lunch. Um, these are pretty good. I mean, they're not like the best, but they're pretty good. That was literally the quickest trip to Ulta in my entire life. <laughs> I've never been in and out of Ulta so quickly, but I got him a fragrance. I have seen this um, line, but not this particular Per, um, fragrance. I'll show you guys when I got this one. Oh, it's so good, y'all. Like, I need to get this for Johnny. <laughs> it smells so good. It smells like woodsy and just like masculine energy. Hey, y'all. So I'm home now. I'm about to change tonight's workout, you guys. I did a 45 minute ride and a five minute cool down. And these are my numbers. Um, I did a ride a cool down with Alex. Um, Toussaint and I did a 45 minute ride with Tunde. It wasn't this ride, but how do I see the rides that I did? Is there a way? 
today is a uh, Wednesday. Through Wednesday. How cool is this? It's too hot for that. Today's Wednesday. I just got down to the city. Um, I'm gonna do my hair real quick because I didn't do it yet. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna use my. This is a wig and weave mousse, but my other mousse is finished. So I'm gonna use this one. I usually just spray this on the brush. This is probably not good at all for the brush, but I don't really care about this brush, y'all. Like, I literally only use it for this. So I just put it on the brush, which y'all probably see me do before, but then I just take it and I put it in my hair. I'm gonna put a little bit of sunscreen. I'm gonna put some sunscreen on. I should have did this earlier, but I was running late and I was trying my best to not be late. So I just ran out the house without any sunscreen today, which is horrible, but uh, I'm putting it on now. Hey guys, so I'm about to start a ride. It says there's a virtual music festival going on today, apparently. Seven. Okay, maybe I'll do this one. Yeah, I'll do a little Hannah. Frankson and these are all songs that I definitely like so I think I'll be able to push through this one and what I usually do if I feel tired I'll do a 20 minute and if I feel like I have more energy then I'll do a 10 minute like um, right after and that way I get a nice 30 minute workout and sometimes I've done two 20 minute ones and then get 40 minutes in so yeah I have my have my water well I have my um this is pre-workout in this bottle. I hope I charge these. Did I charge these? Okay. Ah! Crap. I'm already strapped in. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Thank you. <laughs> Finished. Peloton. Woo. Sweaty. Sweaty. Happy that I'm sweaty. <laughs> Great workout. Bad workout, mommy got 20 sweaty. minute workout. Woo. 20 minute workout. Um, but I do have some energy, you guys. So I'm gonna actually start another 20 minute session. Um, my camera lens is dirty, but hopefully you guys can see. I'm just gonna start this session and just see how it goes. I'm not gonna commit to it, but I'm just gonna start it and hopefully I get through it. Um, but yeah, but this is like a, this is a 20 minute ride with, um, I guess it's like Afro beats, I think. So this is Afro. Okay. Yeah. Like Afro. Brain of boy. All right. So I did like five minutes of that ride, you guys. And I stopped because I'm exhausted at this point, but also I was a little pushed, but also I'm so dumb. I did not realize that the class was in German, so I had no idea what he was saying. I think that was really more so what it was. I was like frustrated because I couldn't figure out what he was saying. So I kept having to look at the numbers to try to figure out what speed we were going at. Um, but after I exit the, exited out the ride, I realized that it's in German. And that's why I couldn't understand what he was saying. But the ride is, it's, the music is really good. It's like Afro beats. It's really like um, high energy life. It's really lively. I really liked it. It's just, it's just that I can't understand. I just can't understand what he's saying. The whole time I couldn't figure out if he was talking English with a strong accent or if he was talking a complete different language. So I kept listening and I'm like, wait, is this English? Like this, is this an accent or is this English? Like I could not figure it out because he would say certain things in English, like whiz kid, he would say in English. So I'm like, okay, that's just because it's a name, but everything else he's saying is not English. Then I kept trying, then I was trying to figure out what language it was if it wasn't English because I just. I knew zero words. Like I knew a few, or I know a few words in um, Spanish, in French, um, but like I couldn't tell anything he was saying. Then he counted at one point. He was counting like five, four, three, two, one, and I knew none of the numbers. And that's when I exited out. I was like, oh no, like I, <laughs> I have no idea. Like it's one. Th like if he was counting down in the language that I kind of knew, then I would have probably stayed. But girl. Girl, it was like, I don't even know what he said, but it was 54321 in German, apparently. And I was like, wait. <laughs> hey, also, I just took a shower, a very long, relaxing shower. I shampooed my hair and I'm just going to put on some deodorants. I'm going to use this one. 
Um, I'm gonna put on some of this body butter from Fenty. Fenty Skin, this smells so good. The buddy, the butter drop. Then I'm gonna put a little bit of this on my chest. This is a glow body um, serum. And then I'm gonna spray a little bit of this on, just like one spray, cause it's like nighttime. Um, but I want some type of fragrance. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. That's what we're doing. I actually need to get back on my natural deodorant wave because I wanna work on um, like basically not using those aluminum ones. So I just got done filming my first video of the night. I wanted to hop on the vlog and check in with you guys. So I filmed Jackie Ina's uh, Doll to Flawless makeup look. I basically like recreated her look following her instructions. And let me just say, I am shook. This looks so good. Shout out to Jackie. What? Period. Like, girl. So anyways, um... I do want to, I have one more video I'm going to film tonight. It's basically going to just be a, I'm just going to film a self-care haul that I got. A self-care haul of things I purchased at Target. Um, so I'm going to just film that really quickly and then I will be done. It's literally 12 10, so I'm really happy because that video is going to take me like 30 minutes or so. Maybe even less. So I'm really happy about that. So anyways, so, so, so. <laughs> anyways, um, I'll check in with you guys once I'm done with that video, I think. But for now, I just got done filming. I'm so excited that I was able to film both videos. I'm actually going to go ahead and start taking off my makeup because I need to go to bed. It's literally 1237. I'm going to start with these, pro these micella wipes. Um, so I could take off my eye makeup and then I'm going to wash my face. I have a lash appointment in the afternoon tomorrow, so... I need to definitely get as much makeup off as I can. I actually thought about skipping this set and then I thought about life with no lash extensions and I just couldn't do it. Especially in the summer, like in the summer a lot of times I don't wear makeup because it's just so hot and it's just uncomfortable. Um, so having lash extensions really just saves the day. It just makes you look instantly more made up i guess like it looks like you have makeup on even when you don't but i guess you technically do <laughs> i guess you technically do you have lash extensions it's like a form of makeup uh, i'm gonna just go under here and just wiggle go wipe off my face real quick well not wipe off but wash my face and i'll be back all right so i just washed my face and i'm gonna just go ahead and try to Make sure I have nothing left on my eyelids. Yo, these lashes look insane. All right, so I'm about to go to bed. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. Today is Friday. Yay. Um, it is 7.27 and I need to get out this line because it's, yeah, I'm gonna be late. This is too long. Wait, how many cars? One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm -mm. That's at least, no. I mean, I need to get out this line, y'all. Um can't do this he's never met the friend or the kid and he right. comes in hey guys all right y'all hey y'all so i just got down to uh, my job basically y'all if i had stayed at starbucks i would have been so late it's literally time not time to go in but i have like 15 minutes before i go in but that line was so long i would have been on there for literally like 20 minutes so i would have been 20 minutes late um, I would have been here 20 minutes later and I would have been definitely late, but I didn't get my coffee. So now I'm going to have to get something else. Well, I was really looking forward to Starbucks today, but I have no choice. By the way, I'm using this sunscreen today from Dermalogica. I usually use different sunscreens in case y'all haven't noticed. I like to try out. I like to switch out my sunscreens and use different ones. I, my lips are super ashy, so I'm going to just use some of this this is from Laneige. this 
this mask? I hope this mask is clean. Yes, it's clean. I was really hoping this mask was clean because I didn't even bring another mask and I have to switch it out when I get to work because we're not allowed to wear like cloth masks at work. Um, because I work in hospital. <laughs> hey y'all, so I just got my coffee. I went to the bank. I got my Starbucks. I got a brown sugar shake and espresso. Y'all already know the deal. This is my first meal of the day and it's 2.30 actually it's 2.15 and my appointment is at 2.30 and I didn't realize that this my appointment is literally one mile away but I guess the traffic is so bad that it's gonna take me uh where did I go? one second y'all because the traffic is so bad I guess it's gonna take me like 16 minutes to get there which I didn't think would happen so now I'm like dang it really should take me like three minutes it should take like three minutes but it's gonna take me 16 minutes so I have four minutes y'all I made it on time I'm so happy I did not think I was gonna make it but I guess the GPS was wrong because it really took it took um, the amount of time I thought it was gonna take which was like five minutes So. Hey guys, so I just got my lashes filled. The lighting is not the best in me. Hey y'all, so new set. Lashes, yes. <laughs> so I wanna redo, like do a little makeover for my living room, my bedroom, my, my whole house. Kitchen, bathroom, bedroom, everything. So I'm starting with the living room and I purchased a new um, area rug and I also got a coffee table. The coffee table is not going to arrive until late August, I think, because I got it from West Elm. Like a lot of things on West Elm, CB2, like they take forever to ship out. Um, so yeah, this coffee table is not going to get here till August, September. But to my surprise the rug that i ordered is arriving tomorrow so i'm really excited about that i was not expecting it to arrive so soon um i did see that it was in stock but i still thought it was gonna come like weeks later because honestly whenever i order from them things do take like a couple weeks to arrive to me so i was really shocked but i'm happy it's coming tomorrow so i can start my living room process i really wish the coffee t the coffee table would come sooner but whatever um i do need to get some decor um for the sofa for the oh i just saw a new nail spot i kind of want to see if they're good Anyways, back to my living room. So my rug is coming in tomorrow. I do want to shop for decor, but I'm probably going to do that in a couple weeks because we have a trip coming up um, and I want to focus on that right now. I also ordered some pieces. I also ordered a couple fun jewelry pieces for summertime. So those are going to come in soon, hopefully tomorrow so I can show y'all and I can wear them. And then I also ordered, um, what was that order? Oh, I ordered a new perfume. So everyone on Twitter was talking about this new Huda Beauty Mona Catan perfume. And I forget what it's called. It's from the brand Kayali, but I forget the name of the perfume. But everyone was talking about it. Everyone kept posting it. And I was like, you know, y'all know I'm a perfume junkie. If you didn't know, then now you know. So I could not resist i had to get it so i ordered it and it's coming tomorrow i'm so excited because girl i love me a good perfume and everyone says it smells really good for summer so i'm really excited about it so, ma'am ma'am why is your dog in the middle of the road ma'am okay let me walk all the way here why is she shaking her head is she shaking her head at me or at her dog? I hope she's shaking her head at her dog. I hope so. Bye, Mom! Mommy! Hi! Yeah? How are you? Hello. Okay. okay. Bye, see you later. 
my kids are at the neighbor's house they live a couple houses down but johnny sits in our driveway and watches the entire street <laughs> so they are supervised just in case you were wondering all right y'all so i just put on this onesie it's from fashion nova i don't know if it's called a onesie what is this called it's like a one a jumpsuit i don't know how the top part goes so i just crossed it because when i wear it regular it just it's it doesn't fit it's like too loose the strings so i crossed it over my head i don't know if that's how it goes y'all anyways i got a package from adina's jewels i wanted to show you guys this was supposed to come tomorrow this was supposed to come in tomorrow but it came early so i figured i would show you guys what i picked up why did they only send me one box Maybe they're both in here. Okay, so this is the little flyer. Ooh, this is the little flyer, and it has a lot of the summer colors on there. And it tells you how to layer. And they're based in Brooklyn, so I should have known that it was going to come quick, but it came really, really quick. This is the box here. And we open it. This is the... Actually, I got something from here recently. Oh, my my anklet. I'm like, this looks so familiar. I'm like, this looks so familiar. I got my anklet from them. I actually forgot. So this is the first piece that I got. This is what it looks like. And like I said, these are both summertime pieces. I really wanted some things for the season. So, this is what this looks like. Like really, really fun. Like these colorful beads are really in right now the, yeah these colorful beads are really in right now and i figured this would be a nice piece and you can extend it to make it like let me show y'all actually did i shave my outfits i think i did um let me show y'all real quick so you can make it like a 16 inch necklace kind of like this you know, these straps are kind of not letting y'all see what that looks like. Maybe I should. So this is what it looks like if it's worn at like a 16 inch length, which you could wear it like a necklace, but you could also wear it more like a choker, which is what I think I'm gonna do with it. So I'll show you guys that. I'm basically just gonna put it on a closer hoop. Okay, so I made it a little tighter and this is how I would probably wear it like this. Show you guys without this necklace this is what it looks like oh this looks really good too so this is it here in the package and i'll take it out so you guys can see it has a little eye and it's white i feel like this one is very easy i feel like this is a one that will i think this will go with a lot of different things it's just a really simple easy look you do feel here so this is what that one looks like i love this one i love it y'all so these are the pieces i love them i'll have them linked down below in case you guys are interested they have a ton of fun designs like on this you can see they have a lot of different fun designs which I think they all look really nice. So. Good morning. Today is Saturday. So I just woke up like an hour ago. Last night was crazy. I literally fell asleep at like 7 o'clock. No, 7.30 something. I don't know. I posted my video at like 6.30. And then I fell asleep at like 7.30 I think is what happened. And I didn't wake up until 1.30 in the morning. And then I was wide awake for like 3 hours. And then I went to bed again at like 3 o'clock or 4 o'clock. Um, now, so yeah, it's now 9.30. I woke up around 8.30ish. I've just been, I've just been kind of just chilling. And then I was chilling for like a good hour before I decided to get my life together. But yeah, anyways, that's what happened last night, I guess. I'm going to just use some lip balm. My lips feel dry. The weather this weekend is not cute, y'all. It is raining all weekend. Um, yesterday I did my lashes and I went really short and this is the shortest I've ever gone and I really like it though it looks really nice I think it looks I like it I really like the way it looks so that's what I did this one actually has a few long um, long strands from the previous set but this is like the true like length that I'm gonna be 
going for. I'm definitely going to do this throughout the summer, I think. It looks really nice. So that's my little set. That's my last set. It looks like your natural lashes, but better. This video should be fun. I'm going to try to do a five product routine. I don't know if that's going to work. I don't know. This That sounds very scary, but I think it'll be fun. I also want to share with you guys an updated lip gloss video. I have one of those, but it's pretty old. So I wanted to do an updated one. And then I wanted to compare the new Maybelline foundation to um, my favorite NARS foundation that I love because those are my top foundations from like drugstore and high end. Right now, NARS, I love that NARS foundation, y'all. And my favorite drugstore foundation is the Maybelline one, but like I the Maybelline Super Stay, but they replaced it with this one here. And I don't know if I mentioned to you guys, why well, I want to focus on this. I don't know if I mentioned to you guys, but I tried this. Um, I think I showed y'all me doing it in my last vlog actually. So anyways, I used this on Father's Day. It lasted so long. Excuse me? I was shook. Yeah? Hey guys, so I just got kind of ready-ish. I threw on this top. This is from Zara. I got it back in February, so I really don't think they have it anymore on this site. But yeah, that's what I'm wearing. I'll show you guys the full outfit once I get up, but I'm about to do my skin with this Miel um, or Melee. Melee tonic. It's basically a toner. I'm just going to wet my face with this. I've been cleaning all morning, so I feel like I'm a little sweaty. Callie's friends having a birthday party. I'm gonna do a light face of makeup, and then I'll show you guys my perfume pick for the day and my outfit once I do my makeup. So we're gonna just, I'm gonna pick out jewelry. I think I'm just gonna wear this today because I don't know. Summary and um, maybe just like these Mommy, little hoops. You know what, no, I'm gonna wear these. Here, these, these hoops here. And my camera's gonna die now. So this is my jewelry and then for watch. I guess I'm just gonna wear my watch because I don't have a watch to wear besides this one that I feel like wearing. <laughs> and I'm gonna take this as well. I'm gonna also use work. All right, so this is my outfit. I'm wearing these American Eagle jeans, this uh, cross body, and my They look arm. like they go together. They do. Two. Get it? Blue tooth. Your next tooth that grows is gonna be a what? A blue tooth. It's blue. A tooth? A blue tooth? A blue tooth? Yeah. With my shoe. And if it rains, I guess we'll swim. What? What? What do you mean if it rains? <laughs> Hey y'all, so we're back home. I, my rug got delivered and <clears throat> and the perfume, so I'm about to show you guys. My camera's gonna die though, so I probably will show y'all in like hey, half wait, an hour look when at I my charge name. it. Look what I was named at the party. Oh, they have pirate names. Well, so what's mine? Yeah. Kelly, so silly. <laughs> <laughs> Can I see the picture? It's a video. 
<laughs> so, um, all right, guys. So this is my new um, area rug. This is from West Elm, and it just arrived. So I'm gonna open it up and show you guys what it looks like. All right. So this is the rug. It's called the Mini Pebble um, Wool Jut Rug. And it's from why did you do Wool Jut Rug? I don't know. So we're just gonna take these out. I'll just start over help. here. Okay. Maybe I'll do this one too. Okay. We're yeah. making it for like a Pull it team. out. If you're, if okay, you're cool. Can I get that? That's just to preserve it. Oops. That doesn't look terrible. The hat doesn't look terrible. It, it, doesn't, it just doesn't right. look. Just look. <laughs> Johnny? Like the yeah, gray and it's it. very soft. Yeah. Right? I feel like I want to tackle Kelly on it. Oh, uh, <laughs> wait. <laughs> Okay, so this is the rug I love. It's a good size too. It's like five. This is a five by eight, I believe. One, two, three, uh, I don't want something too big. I just feel like it would overtake the entire living area. No, this is a perfect size. And um, yeah, I love it. I can't wait to get the little coffee table on here. I think and there's 12. I need to get pillows that kind of bring everything together because this is like more warm tone and this is like cool. So I need to bring some more I warm tones on the couch to tie everything together. What's a warm tone? Warm tone. Warm tone. No, I said warm tones. No, what is a warm tone? Oh, warm tone, it's like a dish, like a little dumpling kind of. Like a dumpling? Isn't a dumpling like that little thing that people eat in like China? Yeah, that's a wonton too, I think. I'll have to Google that. <laughs> Why is that like dumping? I don't know. Dumping. Y'all, so back home. Look. Hey guys, so my camera is charged. I'm going to show you guys the new perfume that I got from Kayali. Alright, so this is the box. I have my little Sephora box. Wait, did I get this from Sephora? I don't remember. Where did I get this from? Huda Beauty. I got it from the site. Huda Beauty site. Um, so this is the paper. I'm like, this is not like Sephora wrapping. This is it here. And comes in this little bag. And this is the bottle. Let me just fix this real quick. So this is my first Kayali uh, fragrance. I've never purchased anything from them. I typically don't really blind buy fragrances online. Like I like to smell them in store. The only time I did that was during the pandemic. Anyways, I got, so this is the pack. This is the box for the perfume. It looks really pretty. It opens like this. And this is the bottle. And this is it here. It looks so pretty. It's like see-through. It's like rose gold. Really nice. It's not even rose gold. It's like an iridescent rose color. It's kind of see-through. You can see the liquid in there, there which is really nice. Cause so let me smell that. Okay, this smell. Hmm. This smells pretty good. Wait, let me spray another. Oh, I gotta let this dry down. This is one of those that you gotta let it dry down a little bit. Oh, this smells nice. It kind of smells like... Ooh. This is one of those perfumes that you gotta let it dry down because once it starts drying, you start experiencing all the aromas. Like, ooh, this smells good. That's when you know. This smells really good. It's called Utopia. It's vanilla. <laughs> no, not you. <laughs> you know, <laughs> I just sprayed it in my mouth. Um, it smells really good, you guys. It actually, it says Utop. The name is Utopia, and it's vanilla and coconut. Those are the main scents, I believe. And that's kind of what I smell, and that's kind of why I got it. Let me tell you guys why I also got it, though. It has pear in there, which I don't know if you, if you saw my perfume favorites video, I mentioned that a lot of my fragrances have pear. So when I saw that it had pear and vanilla, I figured I would like it. So 
I definitely love this scent. It also has jasmine, which is another scent that I tend to like, and sandalwood, and coconut. So these are all fragrances or all scents that I note. All these are all notes that I tend to love. So I decided that, so I, I figured I would like the scent, which I really do. It basically smells like a mixture of all my favorite perfumes, kind of like the ones that have those aromas, it smells like a mixture of all of those. It smells really good. Mmm, I like this. Like, it's one of those things where you just want more. Like, I get some more. <laughs> Do you really want more? And the bottle is just so pretty. Such a pretty bottle. I'm gonna go put it on my. I'm gonna go put it. I'm gonna put it on my fragrance shelf. Okay, so we're gonna put her here for now. Actually, maybe I'll put it like right here. Well, this is such a beautiful bottle. Um, I have two missing on this section, but ooh, yeah, I love it. Welcome to the family. She smells beautiful, you guys.